I'm Martha Mock. I'm a professor at the University of Rochester's Warner School of Education and the director of the Institute for Innovative Transition. And we're here today to talk about people with disabilities living in the community. People with disabilities have the, the same wants and desires as people without disabilities. Being able to have that feeling of independence that you have when you're running your own, your own house or your apartment is an important one. My name is um, Corey Peels, and where we are right now is at Lifetime Assistance um, Supervised um, Apartment. One of the myths that exist sometimes in our society and in, in um, schools as we think about growing up and, and moving out is that people with disabilities can't live alone or don't want to live alone, and that's simply not true. Being independent is a very is a very big um, transition because um, when you're living independently, you get to um, make your own choices. Corey um, has done a, a really nice job of understanding herself and what she wants. Like I kind of want to learn how to budget and learn how to s s um, s pay like rent, like house rents and stuff like that, like like phones. Like my, because my mom it, um, pays f for my um, cell phone bills. So now I kind of would like to take that res that responsibility to do that myself. What's most important is that um, is that families and students get to make those choices themselves, and that they get to see that there are opportunities and that there's communities that are welcoming. Your um, family and the agency work together as a team to find a great, to find a, a safe place to be where it's uncomfortable and you know more what you want <laughs> 